What's up world, I'm Mr. Vaca and welcome back to our Screencastify series. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can easily locate any Screencastify recording that you made and how you can rename them and share them with anyone that you like. So without further ado, let's find out how to locate those recordings. There are multiple ways that you can find these recordings and the first way that I'm gonna show you is my personal favorite and that's just to go to your Google Drive. You wanna make sure that you've logged into Screencastify with the same account that you're using for your Google Drive and if you've done that you will see in your drive a folder that's automatically created called Screencastify and if you open that up you will see all of the recordings that you've ever done while using that account on Screencastify. Right from this spot if you right click on the Screencastify video recording that file you'll be able to rename it right there. In that same right click menu you will find that share button where you can share with anyone that you would like just like how you would with any other Google product. The second way to locate those Screencastify recordings is directly within the Screencastify extension itself. Open up Chrome and then go to your extensions and click on the Screencastify icon. In this pop-up window, you are going to look for the button that looks like a square play button that says My Recordings. Click on that button and it will automatically open up a new tab with all of your recordings. To rename the video, all you need to do is click on that video file and then locate the top title bar where you can then rename the video to whatever you like. Sharing those Screencastify videos through this extension has a lot more options than through Google Drive as well. When you click on that video file, it will open up a new pop-up window on the right hand side where you can get a link to share that file directly with anyone that you like or you even have the ability to get a QR code, find where it is in your drive, send it through Gmail, and many, many more. You even have the ability to send this link straight to your Google Classroom. And that's it. Now you're ready to locate, rename, and share all of your Screencastify recordings. If you like this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell because our next one is going to focus on how to use Screencastify to create videos, make titles, transitions, edit them just like how you would in programs such as Adobe Spark and even iMovie. It's a lot of fun and helps me out along with my other teachers a ton when trying to create fun, engaging movies, videos for our students to actually watch and learn from, whether it's remote or hybrid learning. So thank you again so much for watching. Don't forget to work hard, play hard, and I'll catch you next time.